murder suspect gives money to the chief of police after the murder. I be damned. South Carolina police chief got a loan from Alex Murdaugh. The police chief is Greg Alexander. Now this was one month after a double homicide connected to the Murdaugh family. Let's put up a picture of Mr. Murdaugh, okay? Just over a month after his wife and son were murdered, this South Carolina attorney, Alex Murdaugh, the man at the center of the Murdaugh murders, wrote a $5,000 check to a local law enforcement officer who has acknowledged his extensive ties to the powerful family. Let's put up a picture of the chief, okay? He's chief of Yamasi, South Carolina. His name is Greg Alexander. Uh, he wants you to give him more power. He's now running for sheriff of the county. Let's put up a picture of the check. That's called your smoking gun. That check was received after the double homicide. Mm. The attorney Murdaugh paid a $5,000 check to the chief of police after the double homicide that he's connected to as a person of interest. The check appears to have been dated on March 9th, 2021. But the man who received it, the police chief, Greg Alexander, confirmed to the news outlet Fitz News that it was cut on July 9th, 2021. That was just four and a half weeks after a gruesome double homicide took place in Marseille, the Murdoch family's hunting property located just five miles north of Hampton. Alex Murdoch is officially a person of interest according to the report. In connection with his with this bloody crime, which claimed the lives of his son, Paul Murdoch, and his wife, 52-year-old Maggie Murdoch. In fact, recent reports indicate that there is physical evidence linking Murdoch directly to the shootings, which were exclusive, exclusively reported by Fitz News. In addition to the double homicide inquiry, attorney Murdoch is at the heart of multiple other state and federal investigations related to alleged financial crimes perpetrated by him and a growing network of co-conspirators. As of this writing, he is facing dozens of charges related to the alleged fleecing of nearly $9 million from his former clients. Let's put up his picture again. Now that's a thug, okay? Reached Wednesday evening, Alexander the Chief, who was currently running for sheriff of Hampton County, confirmed receiving the $5,000 check from Attorney Murdaugh. According to the Chief, the money was intended as a loan for his parents. I mean, come on, <laughs> let's not allow a double homicide to get in the way of my mama and daddy needing $5,000. Asked whether the money had been repaid, Chief Alexander said he was unsure and would need to check with his daddy. <laughs> Put up the picture of the chief again, okay? Yeah, see this is what you call corruption, all right? JR, what are your thoughts here? Uh, it, <laughs> First, I want you the co-signer on this uh, whole loan. Your dad should not be one of those five thousand dollars. Hail <laughs> to the now. <laughs> this is your <laughs> your debt, bro. But that's your dad now. Anyways, also five thousand dollars. That's the that's the number. I mean, you should ask for more. This is a financial crimes guy. If you're looking to help him cover it up, you should probably ask for something more. It's more important to him than that. And also, man, there's so many twists and turns here. I feel like, I, I feel like this is an aspect of a Dateline NBC thing. <laughs> right. It was double murder, the wife and the son, and then. 
the police chief was involved. Like you gotta stay away from this stuff. I, I'm, I'm not sure how he didn't see this coming. Yeah.